supplies needed for this project. A chinoiserie tissue paper, Mod Podge, foam paintbrush, scissors, a small bowl, and a sealer, which is optional. There are so many options of chinoiserie paper napkins. I chose this one from Amazon. I will leave the link down below. First thing you want to do is remove the layers of napkins since you only need the top layer. Now I have this cute ceramic little bunnies that I purchased at Home Goods a um, couple of years ago. They were a set of six with the word Easter. One of them broke, so I wanted to repurpose them. So I'm going to cover the letter with two layers of white tissue paper. But you can use any bunny in different sizes and design to create an artistic centerpiece. If they are not white, I recommend you to paint them white for the perfect chinoiserie design. Now we are going to decide which motif we are going to apply first. And then work our way around our little bunny. Now that your motif is cut and ready to use, take your foam brush and apply a thin layer of Mod Podge over the bunny. Apply the glue on the bunny, not the napkin. Attach the tissue to the bunny by simply pressing down with our fingers. Gently smooth out any bubbles and wrinkles. You can add individual motifs to reveal more of the white, or you can cover completely your bunny with your tissue paper. If you are working with a bigger bunny, let the first layer dry completely before you add another piece of paper. Also, I make sure that my fingers are clean without any glue residue when holding the bunny. Made a mistake? Don't worry, just use more glue and overlap it with another napkin. If you still see wrinkles, it's okay. Once it's dry, the napkin will adhere to your item and it won't be noticeable. Lastly, you can use a spray sealer, but I didn't have at the moment. So I added another layer of Mod Podge to the final product and let it dry. And voila, your cute decoupage bunnies are complete. These turned out so beautiful. Look at all those details. This was my first time doing this and it was so relaxing. Perfect addition to my Easter table escape. Please stay tuned for that upcoming video. I hope you got inspired to do some creative DIY for your spring home decor. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for your support and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.